Wow. <laughs> that sounded fucking weird. Hold on. Well, good evening, boys and girls. It's taken a while, but I'm back with another bedtime story. Before I start, I just want to say that I I stream every day on twitch.tv slash uh, Painless Blade. I forgot my own name. Painless Blade. Uh, not every day. I, I stream on some days. Uh, it's a bit hit and miss, but like... I've, I've, I stream on Twitch sometimes. That's all you need to know. Check, check twitch and i go uh all right all right so so i know <laughs> hold on hold on hold on so yeah all right so i haven't re rehearsed this uh at all i'm just going for it but as i said i've just been streaming on twitch with a great bunch of people and and that obviously and uh I just thought I'd record the second bedtime story for you all because uh, I had some drinks and that's what I do now apparently is I, I record shit when I'm on my own uh, to hopefully make you laugh or sleep I haven't got a clue and I forgot what I was going to say oh yeah yeah, I stream on Twitch and I uh, and I've got two followers on on TikTok, uh, which is more than most of you, I would say. I don't like to brag about it, but I've you know I've got two two followers on TikTok. I don't have any videos on there, but when I did have a video on there, I had two likes from random people. So yeah, I went I went kind of viral for a bit. Uh, uh, with those two likes from random people. But anyway. I might burp. Because I'm drunk. I like I burped. Wh uh, when I wasn't recording. And, and some sick came out. But that's what happens when you've been drinking a little bit. Sometimes that'll happen children. And. Uh, don't worry about it. Just swallow it. And it and just smoke or something to take away the taste. No, no, maybe not smoke because you're probably not old enough. But but if you've been drinking, uh, have some Cheerios or something. I don't know what. I don't know. What do kids? What do kids fucking eat these days? What sweets are there for kids? Haribos. Fucking have some Haribos or something. If you've been drinking and you feel sick, have some Haribos. Take away the taste. So yeah, I'm back with another bedtime story. This story is called... This story is called... <laughs> this story is called Spank the Monkey Lends a Hand. By... Bimizzi... Tyanita and it's illustrated by somebody as well which I will put in oh no wait hold on I'll give it a go now <laughs> some guy in Bangladesh and I'm not fucking lying that's what that's what the illustrations are from but anyway I don't know whether this bit's going to go in like the whole the whole fucking me talking bullshit but we'll see. I'll probably forget and just leave it in anyway. But this story, this story, children, is called Spank the Monkey Lends a Hand. <clears throat> if you find yourself alone with much to think about, call Spank the Monkey. He'll come by and help you work things out. Just the other day, while walking on the farm, Spank the monkey stopped to look in Farmer Johnson's barn. The air in there was warm. It smelled of salt and sweat and lotion. Way back in the corner was a constant steady motion. The farmer's arm was moving fast. His hands, they looked so worn. 
Spank the monkey stepped right up and helped him shuck his corn. Perfect. Hold on. Yeah, okay. Spank likes to visit Grandpa, who loves his magazines. He has the first one and the last one, and all the in-betweens. He flips right through the articles until his fingers blister. What he really likes to do is look at all the pictures. That does, that's stretching it a bit. That doesn't even rhyme. Blister and pictures. Ah. Uh, well. <laughs> when. <clears throat> when Grandpa gets excited and messes up an issue, Spank is there to save the day with a box of tissue. Vinny has a job making sauce for pizza pies. As he cooks, he likes to watch the waitresses go by. Vinny grabs his hard salami and he hides it from the boss. Then he goes into the pantry to make some secret sauce. Vinny makes a lot of sauce. He whips it up by hand. Spank has seen the waitress. He can understand. Spank the monkey takes his car to the quick lube service station. They let him fill his jar up there when he's out of lubric lubrication. From underneath a car on Jack's came some grunting and a moan. That dirty old mechanic Max was down there all alone. Max's hands were greasy. His eyes were squinted shut. Spank was there to loop his tool. <laughs> <laughs> and help him bust that nut. Good old Spank. You may have heard it said before. No. I'm, I made up that bit. You may have heard it said that Spank only helps the guys. Please don't cloud your head with all those silly lies. Spank the monkey actually likes girls more than boys. Every girl that he knows has a nightstand full of toys. Sally plays the flute all day in the marching band. She knows that when the day is done, Spank will lend a hand. When Sally goes to bed at night, her face is all aglow. Because Spank the monkey's going to have... <laughs> because... Because uh... Spank the monkey's going to have a finger puppet show. <laughs> Uh, as the sat oh my god as the satin curtains drop she thinks I'm a lucky girl Spank opens with her favourite scene polishing the pearl Sally dims the lights and makes sure the door is locked then Spank the monkey oils her flute and puts it in her box Oh, that was the end. I was just getting into that. Well. I hope you're all asleep now, children. But if you're not, take two minutes out to, uh, to check me out on TikTok. Good night, children. <laughs>